arriba y a la risa tira que tira Un encontrado entre caminos tomados De Siberia hacia la luna o a gira Cosa fea, cosa Chef George Budatakis, author of the book Vegetarian Traditions and the blog TheVegetarianGuy.com. I went to the Hillcrest Farmers Market in San Diego and spoke with farmer Dennis Stowell about his pomegranates. He shares his secrets for making the most of this incredible fruit. Put it under a dishpan of water, cut off the North Pole, cut off the South Pole. This one's a little overripe, but you do four wedges, then you just get it under the water and you go like this, you just push it out. You just push them out under the cold water. And what will happen is as you break them out under the cold water, the white membrane will float to the top and these will go to the bottom. And all you do is just scoop off the white membrane and just pour this through a colander after you get enough uh, fruit clean. But the main thing is get them, make sure they're under the water and you push them out like this. Under the water and they'll be fine. That's how you do it. If I would have had the, if I would have had the uh, dish pan of water, I could have showed you a little better to demonstrate it. So how many uh, pomegranates do you grow? How many trees do you have? 300 trees. Really? These are the variety called wonderful, are the old tradition Persian variety that originated um, in uh, Central Asia that they have kind of a combination of the uh, sweet uh, tart balance. Mm -hmm. And there's other varieties that come in before this that they'll have pinker seeds or lighter colored seeds and they'll be sweeter in uh, terms of their uh, sugar content, but they don't have the uh, the uh, dark, you know, the anthocyanins, that purple color. And that really healthy aspect, right? The, yeah. These are, have the uh, concentration of the superfood elements? Yeah, well, there, there, there's in certain foods, they have the antioxidant fruits seem to be this color, like blueberries, concord grapes, mm -hmm. mulberries, and pomegranates, and it, even raspberries. And that that dark violet color, is, it's, uh, it's a compound called anthocyanin. It's one of the things that's good for your uh, body, for your system has the antioxidants. <laughs> Fun thing is these things. So these have been around for 2,000 years. Uh -huh. And people over there that probably couldn't read or write knew that these are healthy for you for thousands of years. And it took about 20 years ago, 15 years ago, the agronomists finally said, oh gee, these things are healthy. And people knew, have known for 2,000 years. People yeah. in Persia and uh, Uzbekistan. Right. But they're a, uh, they're a wonder food. Remember, connect the dots with your food. Know where your food comes from and support your local farmers. Until next time.